Cal saying that it was his fault that you guys lost the game? Nah, it's, it's BS. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, we missed 12 free throws. You didn't have to call those timeouts if we make 12 free throws. I mean, the game's not even, it's a whole nother you know, momentum of the game if we make our free throws. And if we don't give up runouts. If we give up those two, you know, those two dunks, and it's still not even close. Cal jumped in there. He said, if you're going to block shots and rebound and play defense the way you did, though, he'll just tell you, don't try not to get fouled. You know, I mean, did, did, you did so many other things well today. Is that the frustrating part of, of the way those the free throws turned out? Because you seem to be an a guy that gave his team a, a spark in the second half. Uh, I mean, yeah. But it's just, it just comes with the game, I guess. And you make them. And you miss them, and uh, you know tonight I just missed you know all of them. <laughs> but um, like I said earlier, I'm gonna you know I'm gonna go back. And it's, you know I'm gonna work. It's gonna be one of my my strong like mindset of working on the next couple of days and you know throughout the rest of the season. What was, was that change? Up? What was the change from what to what? Was it like bounces before? The nah, um, I used to hold it down really low, and then come up, and then they said that I had a whole bunch of time where I could mess something up. So now they want me to pause it and then go up. Pause it at your waist. Yeah, or like up higher. So oh, now yeah. I'm like pausing it. That. But then I'm pausing it again before I shoot. So then it's not like one fluid motion and you know, it's, you still have that time where you can mess up on your shot where maybe you put a little too much right and you know, I think that's one of my problems. Yeah, well, the deficit was 17. I mean, the game can go one or two ways. You can get run out of the building or you can do what you all did and get back into it. Is that maybe mentally do anything for you all moving forward given how much Cal said will to win, toughness, all those types? Um, you know, I think it was just big because, you know, two weeks ago we was in the same predicament where, you know, we had went through a week of, you know, you know, Cal's hard, you know, practices and then we go to the game and none of what we did in the whole week where we learned, you know, how to compete and, you know, how to play tough and never carried over to a game. And, you know, last week we did the same thing and it was like, that was one of the biggest emphasis. Are you gonna, you know, carry it over to the game? And not, you know, everybody feels like we did that. So that's, you know, that's a huge step for us. That, you know, we had carried it over to a game. Now we just got to build on, you know, the mistakes we did make. How does it make you feel to when the coach comes out and says, "So this game's on me." Talk about what he told you guys in that locker room. But I know you've had to be feeling a little bit down, you know, free throw line that kind of thing. Um, no, I don't think it was on him because, you know, we we missed 12 free throws and. You know, we had careless turnovers where if we make 12, we make you know half those free throws, it's a whole nother ball game. Or if we, you know, have half the turnovers we had, it's it's really a, you know a whole nother ball game. And I don't you know those two those two timeouts, or whatever. I mean, it could have changed it. It could not. You you don't know.